and I, I got to go, but I, I, I enjoy talking with you all. I want to pray for you guys, and I will pray for you. Um, I just, in, in every research that I've done, all the research that I've done, it, I still believe that Jesus saves everyone that comes to him. So, everyone so, comes to him. So I just got to tell you his one thing. His sacrifice is big enough for all of us. These are the men who had caught his name after them. Yeah. They are still African. Are you still African American? Vespucci and Leo Scipio. Two Edomites. Those are not my forefathers. Yeah. Two guys can't have no baby anyway, so why am I calling myself African American? And that was Jesse Jackass. Well, we call him, yeah. you know, Jesse yeah, Jackass. Yeah, yeah. We call him Jesse Jackass because he's the one that coined that in 1989, we believe. Yeah, if you can look this up, he's the one that said, we're not going to call him color no more, Negro. We're going to call him Jesse. We're going to call him African American. You guys might find this crazy. I spent a lot of time in Africa. Yeah, okay, I was, I spent a lot of time you got in, Israel, you know the, you South got Israel, Africa. you got Israelites on. I see South yeah, Africa, the Boers. They said kill the Boers. Yeah, they call kill. It's really bad over there. I tell you that. But I was over there with, I will tell you, uh, a white woman that saw uh, some trackers, okay, that, and skinners that were working for an outfit, and she called them African Americans in Africa. Yeah. They're trying to steal that land. That's funny. Like, no, they're they're trying to steal that land. They're trying to steal South that's Africa. Right. I'm just like, wait, you, they're not African Americans. Hey. They're Africans from Africa. They're hey. African Americans. Hey, that's they're crazy you say that. Anyway. It's pretty funny. That's yeah. crazy you say that because I'll be watching videos on, on YouTube because they got how they talk about the white people back. They're taking back their land. Yeah. And the white people are trying to steal. They stole that land from the Br the British, stole that land. You know what I'm saying? And, and placed them oh, there. Oh, no, the Afrikaners, the Dutch, is actually who came Are the Dutch? Yeah, yeah. They Same people. See, it don't matter if you was Dutch. Um, British, y'all, they're all the same people. The Russian, they're the same people. Y'all just speak a different language. It's no different when the Spaniards came and stole, raped, robbed, and murdered the Mexicans, the Latino tribes. They were the same people, the same. They were no different from Christopher Columbus. They all just spoke a different language. That's it. And the Africans, they're, they're, they're a whole different uh, We're not tribe. African. African comes from, you know, Ham. Noah had three sons. He had Ham, Japheth, and Shem. We come out of Shem. Yeah, and one more thing. You said grace, right? Yep. Grace isn't a gift. Grace is a period of time to get right. Hey, Our message out here is to repent and to tell you to keep the law, statutes, and commandments. Oh, and no. who you are as, as a... As a oh. If you're truly uh, a Native American, if you're Chocolatel, if you're truly the seed of On your that, father's side, on, on your, your father's side. Not your your mother's side. As a brother, I'm supposed to tell you to repent. The Lord is coming to destruct. And the only way to get on top of that is repentance. That's why Yahweh Shai, the Lord said. And you got to call on his true names. But look at, because oh, you, you know Ham, know you know Africa is a big continent. So this is a, this is out of the dictionary. Ham, Ham, the youngest son of Noah, born probably about 96 years before the flood. And one of the eight persons to live through the flood. He became the progenitor of the dark races. So all the dark races, not the Negroes, but the Egyptians, Ethiopians, Libyans, and Canaanites. See, we're not from Ham. We're Shemites. Israelites. We're Israelites. There's a difference. Even when you got Africa, we got Israelites that are scattered amongst Africa, in West Africa, all South Africa, because we were we were there as refugees. We we were there as refugees. That's the fall of Esau. You know what I'm saying? See, that's the spirit. <laughs> Babylon's falling. Right. Babylon's falling. Right. Hey, I gotta go. Let me give you one scripture before you leave, because yeah. uh, you know I, I, I want give you, you one. Get, if you give me one. Uh, and I want I want you to know that a race war is coming. You know, nation versus nation, kingdom versus kingdom. That, that's that's talk about the end times and, and the war that's coming, you know. But I just want I want to show you that you, that that the Lord has a special people, you know. And He is a chosen. Was that Deuteronomy 76? Huh? Yeah. Yeah, bring it You up. know, He has a chosen race, you know. This is and, a this is a racist. And, tell me if this is a racist scripture or not. And He's right. only give His laws to Israel. That's why we out here to bring back the children back to the Lord. So this is Deuteronomy 7, verse 6. Thou for thou art a holy people unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God has chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all Salaki, above all people that are upon the face of the earth. He's so he right chose here. That's a racist them. scripture right there. I got another scripture that says the other people are like spit. He, he said, said they're nothing. They're, they're nothing. like spit. He said they're like a, a drop from a bucket. So if you are truly a, a, a Gadite, you're a chosen lineage that are supposed to proclaim the Most High and His laws to His people and have them come back. It says don't it's worry not, about the wicked, how they're going to get punished. It's, it's worry gonna, about how the righteous going to well, be gonna take, It's going to take a lot to digest because you never heard this before. Yeah. You never heard this before. Uh, you, know, you might be surprised. I, I do oh, you probably has heard it, bro. Here's the thing. It also says that we all fall short of the glory of God. No doubt. Right? Um, but that's what repentance is. You die daily. You die you daily. Die, I'm 100% with you there. 
you have to die names. And you got to call on the true names. You got to call on the true names. Okay. But being that we all sin, we all fall short of the glory of God. Jesus, when he came back to die for our sins, he, from my understanding and my belief and my faith and my relationship with God, he's standing in the gap for anybody that will come to him. Well, how can we say I only come for the lost sheep of the house of Israel? life and to God is through Jesus, yes? I know you guys don't like the name Jesus. That is his name, name anyway. When, uh, when he, when 2000, Danny, son, well, Danny Collar, there's no J. Well, there's no J. This, this, he said he's a Hebrew. You know, he said the, he was a Hebrew. Edomite, the Edomite right. picture is who they call Jesus, you know? That's Caesar Borges' uh, son. Yeah, I, son. Got, I got the picture. Okay, so, so you understand. Caesar Borges. We believe yeah. in, in, in the Savior. But see, but I'm so saying, can I call how, him the Savior for you? No, so, no but, I'm saying, how, but I'm saying, how can his name be Jesus when the J is only about 100 years old? Do you know what I mean? So they could, it couldn't, his name couldn't be Jesus. I, I'm not going to argue about the name. Ago, yeah. What I'm saying, though, is the Savior. He is a Savior. There was a Savior that came Yeah, Messiah, God. Messiah, the Messiah, the Messiah, the Messiah, yeah. So his name, okay. Yahweh We know his name, though. His name is Yahweh that, That's an ancient Hebrew, Peleu Hebrew. And it says that his name is a strong tower. And, and when trouble comes, we call on him. This is, this is his name in Hebrew right there on that sign. This is true. This is Hebrew from right to left. We don't reread from right to left. So Yahweh, Yah means he, um, you know what I'm saying? Hawasha means he delivers. So Yahweh Shah. That's the Hebrew. That's the true name. Yahweh He's the Savior. Well, I appreciate all talking. When you, when you say Jesus, you're thinking of this white guy. Yeah. That's what no, people I think of. I, I know, know. not tell me I am, because I'm not. Not you, not you. Not you. He's here right now. He's walking around every day. He's, a, he's walking around every day live. He's lying all around the world. <laughs> it says this guy is a vagabond. You know, and get don't get the color twisted. But but Yahweh is a so-called black man. He's a he, living he, power. The way the way they get a uh, uh, Jews from is from Short the tribe Judah. of Judah. Yahweh in Hebrew, Yahweh. Hebrew seven eleven says uh, seven seven thirteen says is evident, evident that, that our, our Lord king, sprang out of Judah. Right. Yeah. So they made a whole religion off out of, of our one tribe. Nationality out of our heritage. <laughs> right. See, that's what they did. They made a whole. Uh, how do you make a false religion out of our actual heritage? They're they're they're, they're imposters, pretending to be us. They are the why enemy. Do th why do you think the black men, uh, Latino people, here it is, we came out with all these great inventions. Rock and roll was created by us. Hip hop was created by us. A lot more all other guy, every goddamn thing was created by us. But we don't all get no we don't get no that. we don't get no account of our labors though. Why? Because it's biblical prophecy. It's biblical prophecy. This is what this is well, we could jump out the gym. You thought the Lord just created us to be this great ass people, to be a goddamn like your bas a basketball player, yeah. a football goddamn player, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we're, we're, uh, everywhere we don't got it. The Lord's name is vain right hey, now. no, I'm not. That's hey, this is the truth. I'm not. I'm not. That, yeah. How's that place? His, his, his name is Yahweh, yeah. yeah. the Most High. So, uh, um, that's his name. A uh, God is a title, you know. If hey, if, if hey, that's hey, so, hey, people. You think of that. Yeah, think of that. I, I, you guys are hung up a lot on names and pictures and stuff, and I'm talking about my relationship. I'm talking right, about right, and the, and that's why I said the message. The one and only God, which you're right, is a descriptor of. Of God, hey, that is, there's a name that you have associated and with. And a that. description, because the book yeah, says. It does say. Hey, but you know what it said, because you said, you say, look at 2 Corinthians 11 and 6. But though I be rude in speech, yet not in knowledge, but we have been thoroughly made manifest among you in all things. So, there's nothing wrong with rude speech. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> there's nothing wrong with rude speech. Hey, I, I got to roll You know they said right, if you... We're going to pack up a little bit, because we haven't been out here for like an hour. Okay? Where are you from? Where are you from? We're from... Um, Cal? He's from, he from L.A. He's from, I'm from Hawaii. 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 Austin, Austin. Yeah. Yeah. You guys, this is your first trip down here? No, nah, we've been out here all the time. Oh, we, 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 we I don't get to this town very often. Oh, you know. I live out in oh, the country. He, oh, he lives right out there with you. You live right here probably. He lives out there yeah. in the country. In Yoker? Yeah, in Yoker. He lives yeah. in Yoker. Alright, I'm afraid <laughs> for you guys. Alright, alright. All right. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? My name is Abraham Elijah. Hey, remember, he's an Israelite from the tribe of Gad. Tribe of Gad. He's from my tribe. Hey, hey, love your try. people, yeah. love your people. Yeah. Negro, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. That's your people. Hey, we the only ones hate our people. Oh. Everybody else love their kind. White man love his kind and he still kill his kind. <laughs> 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 our people, we have an evil eye towards our own kind, man. Hey, Deuteronomy. Hey, a lot of that, a lot of that, when we were talking, it didn't get on there because I forgot to push. We were so oh. into it and then you had me. 
I couldn't find the nah, you, one, you was, one thing. You was, uh, I couldn't find it. It was back in the back. You, got. Hey. you gotta go over and look at all the pictures so yeah. you remember it. Hey. You know, I don't know what, what, what was that. Which way is it? Did he help you out? You was, uh, You're the picture guy. You gotta, I, I said, you gotta go over and look at all the pictures so you know which one. Yeah. Hey, no, you go over there. Yeah, but, but one thing he knows from me, but he knows that that, that movie really hard though. Uh, you probably did his own work, he knows it. Yeah, yeah, but you really want to put that in my head, because it's like, it's like his... He want to love everybody. Our people have a zeal for the most yeah, time, but not enough. Yeah, come. Like he said, but... They have that church, that church Christianity spirit. He's trying to bubble that thing, what he learned in that Christian church, you know. That lie. Look like his mother probably was a Edomite, you know, his dad was a, you know, part of the crowd, gag, you know, like I said, he used to stay in America. See how that's how people feel. They want to love everybody. He said, you, you know, you brung it out about about uh, uh, he only came for, for you know for the tribe of Israel. He he still didn't get that man. He still didn't get that. He he it's been, great. Every yeah, man for everybody. He should break that down. What I said on the last sheep of house of Israel. Why did he why did he go to the Samaritan one? Why did he make that a factor that um, um don't go into the way of the Gentiles or the, yeah, or the Samaritan. Go yeah. into the house. Uh, he, he, Israel, couldn't, he, couldn't, he couldn't break it down. Remember, you told him to break this down. That you told me to chose the people. He couldn't break that down. He's still like he, he been he been brainwashed. That's what we we tell him two thirds of our people they brainwashed, man. He they, had they, a lot they need of to come out that. Did What's we up? answer? He, he had a lot of questions. Did we answer? I mean, he we was he was all around. So every time he we, didn't let us get one. He didn't yeah, get. I said, yeah. Yeah, he did. we, we, we let him know that the Lord is a so called black man. Name right. does matter. You can't call on Jesus because that name doesn't exist. You know what I mean? All right. How the hell are you gonna call on Jesus? And what what the, Jesus gonna do for you? Nothing in that day. You ain't know what I mean? Never done nothing for him anyway. Yeah, nigga, our people been knew the goddamn name Jesus. You know what I mean? Yeah, for what Jesus Christ. Jesus put them in slavery. Yep. They called him a person, the man who put them in slavery. Asking the man to walk this earth, like you said. They called him so called white man. Well, that's why. That's why you know. He, he was born in Spain. Now he looked kind of Hispanic too. When you looked at him, he didn't look like white. Like yeah, I was telling them, you know, that the message is to repent because if if you if now you know you're Israelite, the Lord said now you now that you know you're Israelite, sure. Hey, come. Hey, that was spirit. You see the dude fall, Esau's ass about to break. The brother didn't help him up. I know. <laughs> I'm hoping to help his ass up. I know. I was. Yeah. Brother just looked at me like, you know. <laughs> and he was, he was offended. Hey, you when, see, when, when it said it said watch out for the. It, it says, if you offended from the word, you offended of me. Yep. Yep. You know, so we said Babylon is falling. You know, it's yep. like, hey, well, I'm bringing out that for Esau's in the world, and we'll wrap it up with that. Cause it's like three, four. <laughs> he, 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 he would listen, but then he he was like confused with it. Cause like this is the first time ever here. He, he go to this hall, the whole church. They don't bring this on. He ain't never heard this in his life. No, nope. <laughs> he like, you know how you how well, you, you know, go to somebody well, for you know, the first thing, time. But the thing with me though. Even when I went to church, I knew the shit. It didn't feel, it didn't feel right with my soul anyway. It didn't did feel right. You're right. It didn't feel right. Like, goddamn. They, they got this so-called white man up here on the cross, and he the one got our people and, and where we at. He owns everything. He, he, he got our people slavery. He murdered our people. That just seemed like when I was little, though, man. Yeah, uh, yeah. Hey, he had a mighty name, too. He had a mighty uh, name. See that? Yeah, and, and with that name, he he, he going to think he's father of all nations. Bring it up. Uh, Come on, this is... The book of the book of Second Ezra, chapter Second Ezra is chapter <laughs> six, verse eight, and he said unto me, from Abraham unto Isaac, when Jacob and Esau were born of him, Jacob's hand held first the heel of Esau, for Esau is the end of the world, and Jacob is the beginning of it. That follow it. Okay, so Esau is the, the, the end of the world. See, he, this is Esau world now. We this is Esau world. So he runs everything. You want to blame somebody? Blame it on Esau. This is his world. Esau the end of the world, and this is the end of the world. He said Esau will be ruling in the end, and right. e Esau ruling. That's what we told that, that that brother right there. You know, Esau ruling the end, and Jacob is the. It's, it's come after Esau. Jacob, it's, it's the Esau the end of the world, but Jacob is the beginning of the end of after Esau world going. Who the Jacob so called black is and Native American? That's uh -huh. us. We got that. You know what, what? What people? They don't get it. 
you know, the, the, but, but, okay. they said they believe in the Bible though, but when you bring it out, they they, they be they, they get they they get they don't say nothing. They don't yeah. say nothing, but they but said they everybody. believe in the Bible. Cause remember, I asked him, do you believe in the Bible? He said, yeah, but then when you read it, he got quiet like he really didn't believe. What you said? No, and and that's symbolic of, of what Scripture just said that that uh, Jacob's hand is on Esau's heel. Oh. So Esau, your ass is is prepared for slavery. Right, bringing Esau down, nah. bringing Esau down. So you know. So with that, so with that, I hope you edify. Uh -huh. And I like to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem Kadash. Double honor to the apostle, the elder, great millstone for teaching this 100% truth. And I want to say, keep pushing because hey, this is the end. Hey, we at the end. This is Esau world, Esau world going down. That's it. You know, we we got next. Kwame Yashar. Kwame Yashar. Kwame Yashar.